Hey guys, today I want to talk about my blast cabinet that I bought. Uh, it's a Harbor Freight brand. It seems to be pretty decent. Uh, bought it from a, bought it used from an individual. He bought a caster set and put on the bottom of it, so it makes it easier to move. Uh, I can roll it in and out of my basement real easy. Uh, but another thing that I wanted to show you is this little deal here. I bought it at Harbor Freight yesterday and I bought a Craftsman vacuum cleaner from Lowe's actually. Uh, all, this, uh, all this is new and I can show you how good it actually works. Um, uh, this is the box that it came in. I just wanted to give you a review. There's your part number right there at the top. Uh, let's see. This is going to be the front of the box right here. Um, Claims that it captures 99% of the dust. We're going to review that today since, like I said, it's all brand new. Uh, so here's the bucket. I just got a used hydraulic bucket. Of course, cleaned it out real well. Got all the oil out of it. Uh, oh, another thing. So what comes in the kit is it comes with the cyclone, the top, uh, the tube, two clamps, and an adapter. So you can fit a vacuum. So See, my vacuum took the smallest uh, adapter, so you can go to whatever size you really need. Uh, there's the pipe. I popped it into the back of the cabinet right here. Uh, let's pop this open so you can see the inside. So uh, it goes, all the dust comes in and goes into the bottom right here. I had to open up the side right there so it can breathe, but it cleans up really well. I can probably show you a video of it running. Uh, so got the so back to the bucket. Um, I've already popped this open. It does. You have to actually seal it up for it to work. Um, so let's see if we can get a picture of the dust. So it's all dust. Um, pretty good. I mean, it's, uh, as you can see, it's not that much dust in there, but. I've already popped the, uh, I gotta repop the vacuum open. Let's see. Open it up one handed. This is gonna be a little interesting. Uh, it's gonna be a little challenging. Let's get a foot in there. All right, so this is all that came into the vacuum cleaner. Actually, just put it on the side. This doesn't really have any on the bottom. Filter uh, it does have some on the filter. I mean, it's still working. Probably have to dust that out every once in a while. Uh, now this, I did use it for. Out of the way. I did use it for probably a couple hours, and that's all it collected. And it, like I said, it does work amazingly. So I would recommend it. Uh, I think the Bayer uh, I want to say that was $40 <clears throat> so the top and actually the vacuum cleaner was $40 as well so $80 in this setup and for the how well it works I think it's $80 well spent um, let me know what you think comments uh, if anybody has a cyclone or whatever uh the what do you call it the dust buster and let me know how well that works compared to this one uh, i'm very interested i know this one's a lot cheaper than that one uh, i think it was 65 or 70 on amazon or something like that i'm just kind of curious how well 40 dollars does to the 70 and if uh if it's actually worth buying the more expensive one um Anyway, I guess this is all for now. I hope everybody enjoyed the video and uh, the new $40 piece that you can buy now from Harbor Freight. Less money and you can get it the same day. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, like and subscribe and hopefully I can come out with something else.